and we live yeah so basically i'm going to be showing you exactly how to create designs directly on ChatGPT, right leveraging canva right which is obviously the design software i've been using for years now and i think this collaboration makes a lot of sense i spoke about it in one of my videos uh so i want to be demonstrating it to you live exactly first thing you need to have is obviously you need to have a chat gpt subscription because that allows you to use plugins and canva is going to be used as a plugin with the platform so what you want to do is once you have this subscription you will move over to plugins then you select the plugin that you want so i've already installed canva as you can see over here right um if you haven't all you have to do is go to the plugin store and search for canva and you would find canva um over here like that so another thing you want to install is something that can access the internet right they are a lot of things right it doesn't have to be the one i'm using um but i would recommend you use it um it's called um what's it called oh, <laughs> open no it's called vox script i'll use vox script for this one i haven't installed vox script yet right and there is another one um i think it's browser op if i'm correct that's what i was trying to remember yeah, browser op is over here this helps you browse the web page in one of more queries and you can use three at a time so that's why i'm using this enable search on youtube this is a little bit more specific on things like youtube um transcripts and the like so i'm going to, that's why i selected the three of them so i'll move over back here as you can see voice script is selected already move over to browser op select it make sure i canva obviously make sure it's selected so those are the three again there are multiple options but you can't obviously substitute Canva and you can't substitute Vox scripts, right? Browser OP, you might have multiple options, but I'll go with browser OP as at this recording. Okay, so once you have that set up, our setup is complete, right? That's all the boring stuff. Let's get to the actual um, creation. So I'm going to copy my prompts. I've already written it already. Let me put it. So, yep, move it over here. Okay, so what I'm asking is, is give me different stoic sayings and quotes um that would go amazingly well on object like let me just say like artwork for example it could be anything right doesn't matter um, um ps use vox scripts okay so this is the, the prompt that i'm going to use so this could be anything from you know mugs to t-shirts to laptop design cover anything you want right and um, let's see what it will give okay so you use work scripts and um, here are some stoic saying and quotes that will go great on artwork so now that's as that's loading right as you can see um basically what vox script does is you know it's not just giving us quotes that are just um not i don't know the word to use um quotes that are well accepted it's giving us quotes that are well accepted okay because it could give us any amount of quotes but uh it browses the internet right and it makes sure it gives the best quotes that are you know already being um spread and people generally accept you know what i'm saying so look at this um, we have two years one month we should listen more than we say learn to be indifferent to what makes no difference okay basically all of them so now once we have those quotes in place right we will then create another prompts and this is when we're going to be using canva directly so i say um create amazing and unforgettable classic designs that would go great from a stoic point of view um and include various colors and fonts right so again if this is you know from a music point of view if you want music quotes from an anime point of view from whatever point of view that it is you just change this to that and you know include various fonts and size so in the ps section i say use canva preferably a size of 4000 to 4000 pixels so whatever size you want you select it over here and once you've done that go for it so stoic inspired design templates from canva that you can create customize and an unforgettable epic design So it's completed as you can see the multiple designs um that is created and you know it's left for us to select one so let me just go with this one i move over to canva it's going to open canva and basically it serves as a layout that you can then use optimize to actually create that design that you're looking for so this is pretty um uh, what's it called i like the simple minimalistic approach it went you can always reload it um or regenerate to give you more designs right and if you want different types of colors you could always you know say you should or you could just move over to canva and make it work so let's see so here we are 
and as we're in Canva, right? I really like this design, pretty straightforward. So we could move over back to um to ChatGPT and you know go over to better to trip with the feed than with the tongue. Okay, so this is the code we want to use, and we move over to this, and I could just. them move this and use this for the person that mentioned it who said that oh we didn't get a name oh okay so for the purpose of just this design right for just this design let me say Seneca could always ask that GPT for who said that and use the actual um, name we'll put it and yeah we already have a pretty nice artwork design for you know they could use, print it out, post it up on my wall and the likes, right? And you could always, again, customize anything you want, you know, to change the colors. You know how Canva works, right? So basically, that is it. And if you want more design, you could always ask to regenerate to give you different types of designs and simply straightforward, right? So it is what's exactly um, the new feature that it's available. Right now, obviously, it's going to get better. It's going to get better over time, but... It's pretty straightforward, don't you think? So let me know what you think, suggestions, comments, and how you, you know, are using this to make amazing designs for whatever it is that you want. And I really hope you found value to this. So without further ado, we'll see you in the next video.